If you see this in the jungle, do not go near it. Welcome back, Charlie here. I found the scariest things ever discovered in the jungle. From unexplained humanoid creatures caught on camera, to giant footprints in the ground that have a very scary backstory. First, we have to look at this humanoid caught on camera. In 2017, a biker was traveling through the jungle in Indonesia. That's when a tiny human-like creature carrying a spear can be seen. It runs out of the jungle before noticing the people on bikes. It looks at them for a brief moment and then runs away. Some believe this could be a member of a lost pygmy tribe. There are various uncontacted tribes in the area, but that doesn't account for how small this person is. Others said this may not be a human, but instead a humanoid creature. Some believe this could be a member of the Mate tribe. This is an ancient, believed extinct tribe of people who used to live in northern Sumatra. The jungles here are incredibly dense, so there's no telling what could be hiding inside them. Some locals do claim that tribes live in the caves and mountains of Sumatra. The video was filmed by a man named Fredo Pastrana. In response to the speculation around his video, he said that it's not fake, but he did say he does not want to comment on what it could be. He said he wasn't sure whether it's a tribe's person, a humanoid, or something else. In response to the video, the regional government said they would set up a team to investigate and search for whatever this is. But so far, nothing has turned up. Moving on, we have to look at these giant footprints. Researchers have recently found gigantic footprints impressed into stone. These have been found in various different countries, and some of the footprints are hundreds of millions of years old. But who do these footprints belong to? Locals say that the footprints belong to Lord Hanuman. They've been found in India, Thailand, and Sri Lanka. But there have even been large footprints found in other parts of the world parts where Lord Hanuman never went to. This suggests some kind of ancient, gigantic person or animal could have lived in these places. Could these really be the marks of super powerful extinct beings? Some even believe that these footprints are proof that gigantic humans like Cro-Magnons once roamed the earth. Moving on, we have to look at this man. This unbelievable man was found in the jungles of Vietnam. Many say that this man is the real life Tarzan. His name is Ho Van Lang and he survived alone in the Vietnamese jungle for 40 years. In 1972, he fled to the jungle with his father. This was after much of their family lost their lives in the Vietnam War. Ho and his father lived by eating corn and foraging for berries. Eventually, they learned to adapt to life in the jungle. They wore clothing made of tree bark and built a hut using wood. After 40 years, Ho was found by locals who were getting firewood. When they first interacted with people outside of the jungle, they thought the war was still going on, even though it had ended just one year after they went into the jungle. Over time, they adapted to modern civilization. When Ho came out of the jungle, he had no idea women even existed. He was only eight years old when he went into the jungle with his dad, and he'd completely forgotten what a woman even was after 40 years. In 2021, Ho Vang Lang sadly passed away of cancer at 52. Moving on, we have to look at the Amazon rings. All around Brazil and the Amazon rainforest are gigantic, mysterious rings. These predate the rainforest, and are a total mystery to archaeologists. Some believe these may have been used as burial grounds, or some kind of defense mechanism created by an ancient civilization. Others say these could be landing marks from UFOs, but there's no proof of this. It's most likely that the indigenous people to these areas constructed these, but that poses a big question. How could they have done this without any sophisticated tools? Some believe these rings are proof that ancient civilizations were more advanced than we think. Next, we have to look at the scariest animal ever found in the jungle. This is the zombie ant. Although this ant is dead, it's moving around like it's a Alive. These zombie ants are created thanks to a fungi. This parasitic fungus can control the minds of insects, turning them into real-life zombies. The fungus is called Ophiocordyceps unilateris. The fungus can be found in jungles and rainforests all over the world. The fungus first infects an ant. The fungus then consumes the insect and controls its mind. The zombie ants will then go around biting other ants, spreading the fungus even more. It's literally like a zombie apocalypse from a movie, only this time with ants. Let's just hope no funguses exist that do this to humans or larger animals. Otherwise, we could have a real-life zombie apocalypse. Moving on, we have to look at this very mysterious video. One creature rumored to live in the jungle is the Sasquatch. This video appears to have caught a Sasquatch on camera. 
It was recorded by a man who was hiking in the jungle. That's when he came across this gigantic creature. Although the Sasquatch is camouflaged, it can be seen moving various times in the video. It seems to scale up this steep hill with relative ease, suggesting it's much stronger and agile than a human. What do you think this could possibly be? Moving on, let's look at the stone spheres of Costa Rica. If you're ever hiking in the jungles of Costa Rica, you may see these massive stone spheres. What are these stone spheres? Who made them? And how are they so perfectly round? So far, over 300 of these spheres have been found. For many decades, it was a total mystery as to what these were, but we now know the truth. It's believed these were created by the Dequise people. This was a small tribe who lived in the area. They created these amazing stone spheres without any modern tools. It's believed they were made over many years by rolling them on hard rock. They would start out as normal rocks, but over time would be rolled into a sphere shape. This would have taken an immense amount of dedication and time, and that's why they've been preserved to this day. Finally, we have to look at this fruit. Just imagine walking through the jungle and seeing this growing from a tree. This is actually the Hakrapona palm tree fruit. They have these large, very strange looking stems that can grow up to 40 centimeters in length. Because of the way it looks, some believe that eating this fruit can actually increase the size of your you-know-what. But experts say that there's no proof of this just yet. And some experts even say not to go near this fruit if you see it in the jungle. That's because it looks similar to the Phallus rumicundus. This is a different fruit which can be poisonous. So be very careful before eating anything you find out in the jungle, even if it does look so good. But now it's time for you to make your voice heard. Comment down below which was the most surprising thing found in the jungle. If you want to see my short videos, then check out my shorts channel. If you want to see my shorts videos, then check out my shorts channel. I've been Charlie, thanks for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed, and if you haven't already, then what are you waiting for? Subscribe to Top 10s.